It seems this summer is just full of nostalgia. Dungeons and Dragons, DuckTales, and now Flashback. But what exactly is Flashback? Well, it's fair to assume a lot of you watching this video were too young or not even born when it came out on the Amiga and DOS. After years of slumbering, Ubisoft has finally decided to bring back this classic series, but is it worth remembering or should it just be forgotten? Flashback puts you in the role of Conrad, an agent stationed on Titan who awakens in the jungle from amnesia. Later on discover that your mind has been completely wiped out and must unravel a conspiracy that could annihilate the human race. For the most part, it decides to stay true to the original game script. The main gripe I had with the narrative had to be the cheesy dialogue and voice acting. They sound like they're reading it off from a script and even then the script itself just seems like it was written by a 12 year old. What? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, great. You didn't even tell me. Mm. Awesome sauce. Graphics are also incredibly choppy on the Xbox 360 version. Slowdowns and screen tearing just bring down the overall experience. Adding to that, the game is riddled with bugs, some that even break the game. Shooting a robot, for example, causes it to explode and if you're caught in the blast radius, your character will just stop moving, forcing you to open the menu and restart. It happened to me on numerous occasions and it's just frustrating. These bugs may have passed 20 years ago, but today it's just unacceptable. Controls also feel sluggish and somewhat unresponsive. Jumping and grabbing objects have awkward animations and the physics is just atrocious. Gun mechanics do work well and is quite fun. The game does try to offer some variety with missions and items such as using your visors to see through objects. Flashback is just not a good game. The poor presentation, game breaking glitches and horrible narrative just don't make it feel engaging at all. Even the classic version which comes included gave me some weird issues. Shadow Complex, a game that came out more than 3 years ago, has managed to achieve all of this and more. If you're a fan or someone who wishes to relive the classic Amiga game, then you will be ultimately disappointed. Flashback is just better off kept in your memories. better.